Good morning. What a magical place. I can't believe I'm in Arizona right now. And Champ doesn't seem to want to leave the land of a million sticks and snow, his two favorite things. But uh, we're gonna hit the road. There's a hot spring apparently nearby, although reports are a little iffy, so I'm gonna go check that one out. And uh, I'm trying to keep my expectations low, you know, but I do love hot springs. I am a big fan. I'm just trying to ready myself in case it's not there anymore or something's wrong or something's different, but that's it. That's all. I'm a little too uh, sore still, I think, to really do another motorcycle ride. I kind of want to ride this area, but it's like muddy and frozen and, and my when it's cold, my heel hurts even worse. So I'm just going to just going to get to the hot springs and soak this this aching foot and everything will be good. All right, let's hit the road. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go. Come on, up, up. Have a little pit stop and to make some breakfast. Ooh. Want some breakfast? Wanna go for a walk? Yeah, I thought so.
Well, that's the end of the motorbike ride. What an intense road, man. That is by far the craziest road I've ever ridden. And the, the craziest bit is, it's super long. I only filmed a little bit of it because eventually it just got too intense. And I was coming down just the last little bit, which is super steep and intense. And I was like really sketched out on my tiny little motorbike. And what's coming back the other way? A Toyota Prius. Some couple in a Toyota Prius did that whole road. That's crazy. All right, some bad news. <laughs> the river is totally swollen up and uh, I can't get across without swimming. I don't really want to swim across this river because it's brown, I can't see anything in it. I, American rivers have like alligators and stuff in them sometimes. Although I doubt that's the case here. I just, the water is very cold, very swiftly moving. And uh, I don't have any backup. There's nobody here, nobody to tell my story should I die here, so. Don't think it's worth it. I'm just gonna, I've already gone way past my comfort zone. In this hike after all of that motorbiking, which has left me pretty swamped. It just sucks, it's like hot spring apparently is just across this river. It's another 200 feet from me and I can't get to it. But nobody's going to the hot spring today. Everybody I met who was coming back while I was going down, they all said that they weren't gonna do it, didn't do it, so. I'm not the only one pansying out. All right, let's get back to the van. You know, I'm just swamped. It's a bit of a, it's like eating the whole cake without the cherry on top that I didn't get to that hot spring. I'm a little bummed about it, but at the same time, like, that has got to be one of the best trails, roads I have ever ridden, and it was just intense. And I wasn't expecting to do that today, but, you know, life has its ways. Uh, I'm going to keep hitting the road and see if I can't find some Wi-Fi to upload a couple episodes and, and somewhere to park up for the night. I'm also really starving, so food would be nice too. Oh, we got ourselves a fantastic camping spot. How cool is this? I've had so many great camping spots over the last little while. It brings up a good point though. If you are interested in my research, not just this place, but like every place I've camped and all the stuff I find and all the research I've been doing for the last three years, it's actually one of the perks on my Patreon. I share my My Maps account, Google My Maps. I share my little private map there. It's got hundreds and hundreds of cool points and stuff to check out if you're thinking of traveling, you know, maybe, hey, just Patreon, just, you can just like Patreon for like a month and then like get it and then, you know, cut your subscription, that's fine. But I'm only offering that on Patreon, so hit me up there. Uh, because you know what, honestly guys, Patreon is like a huge part of my income. Like comparatively, this last 
two months or last month I made uh, like $198 in ad revenue and I made like $454 in Patreon after the service fees and stuff like that's a pretty significant chunk so yeah Patreon's where it's at man so thank you guys for watching thanks for sticking with me thanks for like your patience because I'm figuring this camera out sometimes it's awesome sometimes it's not there's like a lot of menu stuff I'm trying to like program I'll figure it out it's coming soon but right now to finish off the episode i'm just going to tuck in a time lapse and hope to god it's better than yesterday's okay okay <laughs>